What is up, y'all? And welcome to my nighttime routine with a baby. No more newborn videos because baby girl is five months. Well, she's almost five months. So the first thing we do is get her winding down because she'd be a little bit too hyper and it's almost time for bed. So I'm just playing with her. We've got a whole bunch of development toys for her and everything just goes directly in her mouth. But I love these little socks and these wristlets. They're like jingly and she can start to learn like her wrists and play with her feet and all of that type of stuff. It's so cute to watch. But yes, baby girl's almost five months. So we are getting her on a routine well she really is on a routine already so it's about 5 30 right now but she does go down at 6 30 so at 5 30 we're just starting the process winding her down getting her tired so she can sleep throughout the night because she usually sleeps throughout the night and do you see her sitting up girl she literally almost can sit up on her own but not yet <laughs> but it's close like it's really crazy she is growing up so fast right before our eyes so we're gonna go ahead and head downstairs girl we got a lot to do i'm going to put her in her swing because i want to get comfortable i want to relax because we got a long routine we got to get into and i'm in my work clothes i just got out of work so i want to go ahead and get comfortable wind down and i'm going to show you my favorite loungewear ever Tommy John is my go-to when I need something comfy and cozy to wear around the house. Tommy John wants men and women to feel comfortable to be their true selves with no adjustment needed underwear and apparel. A matter of fact, comfort is at the core of everything they do. Tommy John stands out because of their premium quality of apparel. These loungewear and pajama sets are quite literally the most comfortable clothing I own. Plus, they're designed for motion. That means no pinching, bunching, or riding up. I love wearing these sets around the house and I got so many compliments from my family during the holiday. Tommy John has a wide variety of apparel and undergarments so you can find the exact pieces to fit your vibe. Start the new year with the best in comfort. Click the link in my description box and use my code MAYAPG to get an exclusive 25% off plus free shipping on orders over $75. Shop Tommy John today. Okay, so y'all know me and I have to implement a nightly cleanup every single night. So I just put Genesis in her little swing. She's chilling, she's cool. And I'm picking up all of her toys, her bibs, her bottles, her play mats, everything that's just around the house. I found that doing like a 20 minute cleanup every night in the main living space allows me to take power and take authority over my home because sometimes like our homes can become overwhelming because they're so messy and then it affects our mental health and i'm like no man pam i am big on prevention over here so i do these little nightly cleanups and i also make sure to wash her toys every single night all of the toys that go like directly into her mouth which is really these two toys that she loves to chew on so i make sure to wash those but we'll get into that later but for right now can we just admire how beautiful my daughter is like i know the hair is a little crazy but girl you are so cute okay y'all let's head upstairs and really start this routine and get into bath time bath time i don't know about y'all but i literally love giving my daughter baths it's just so soothing like i just love singing to her and talking to her and it's really peaceful but i'm wiping out her tub with some draft this is a draft all-purpose cleaner for babies so it's safe and i'm making sure to even rinse out the residue just in case there's anything like left over you know girl we gotta be real safe real careful around here but i want to show you guys what i use for her bath so we just got a little baby washcloth this little pitcher we've got the proudly gentle wash we're still using this and love it and the lotion as well oh my god can we just look at her oh my gosh she loves baths y'all y'all do not understand she gets so happy in the tub and it just makes me happy but listen if you want that baby to go down at night give her a bath give her him whatever a bath because seriously she just knocks out after she had a bath we really do only bathe her like three times a week because she's a baby but when we do give her baths we definitely see that she goes to bed way quicker 
so gave her a quick little bath it does not take long but i'm just making sure to you know wash her parts wash the palm of their hands y'all because their hands are always dirty and then i'm going to put some desitin on her bottom because she is going to be sleep and usually she sleeps like through the night so that's why i put the desitin on just to prevent any diaper rash we usually use pamper pures but upstairs we only have our huggies but i definitely would recommend pamper pures they're really absorbent and she rarely ever leaks through them and i just had to get this angle because she was staring at the camera y'all and i thought it was the funniest thing ever but i'm just rubbing her down in her little lotion i love the smell of this lotion it's very calming it's got like a lavender scent to it so it definitely helps to put her right to sleep i give her a little massage on her feet and then i'm gonna find her something to wear i usually like to find a onesie something a little bit thicker because it is colder so i found her this cute little um white one but definitely something more warm rather than just like a daytime onesie because i want her to be you know very warm throughout the night especially because she's gonna have no body movement so her body temperature is naturally going to be lower so i was waiting on my husband to finish up work so i could hand genesis to him so i can go prepare her bottle but in this time i was just singing to her speaking life over her okay come on somebody seriously like i just i don't know i feel like there's such a stigma on parenthood but let me just say i love parenthood i love motherhood i think it's the most beautiful thing ever and though it's very hard it is very rewarding in such a journey and just so beautiful but anyways we're gonna head downstairs so i can show you guys how i make her bottle what i use all that type of stuff giving her to her daddy and not forgetting to take those diapers downstairs because i forgot last time but girl we bringing them down <laughs> So when I went downstairs, I saw that my man was cooking. Girl, it smells so good. He made like this whole beef ramen something situation. It was good. I don't know. It was really bomb. So I want to show you guys what I use to make her bottles. As you guys know, I did switch from breastfeeding to formula and it's been going really, really good, y'all. Like I'm just so relieved. All the breastfeeding mamas out there, y'all are amazing. I breastfed for four months and it was so hard it was so hard of course of course it was rewarding but it was very challenging so if you're out there breastfeeding or not because motherhood is hard period so whether you're breastfeeding or formula feeding girl you're still doing the thing but we use the happy baby organic formula it's modeled after breast milk and it's worked so well she does not suffer from constipation or anything like that and to make sure she doesn't we use a probiotic and we do five drops of this probiotic it's from mommy's bliss you can find it on amazon and i'll link it down below and this really just helps to ease any potential constipation that she may have but yeah love this combo it's so amazing and we also use baby water i don't know if you guys saw but that was baby water that we were using i really don't think there's any difference but we just use it <laughs> just to say we're using baby water we're gonna use our mom cozy warmer now i have heard some moms say that like when they warm up formula bottles it may clump but we haven't experienced that but definitely make sure that you're shaking it thoroughly so there's no clumped formula now it is time to wash all of her bottles and her toys from the day and i am going to sanitize i sanitize like every other day i don't sanitize every single bottle i give her but i make sure that you know when i have the time that i'll do that and i think a big thing for like getting things done is just whenever you have downtime try to tackle the tasks that you've been avoiding like for me doing bottles y'all i don't know like cleaning bottles is something that i procrastinate on so i was like okay while the bottle's warming up i'm just gonna clean these bottles and i also recommend using only like four bottles a day if you're using like 10 bottles throughout the day baby you're gonna have 10 bottles to clean at night so use like four bottles so you're forced to clean those four bottles and it's just gonna be way easier on you okay so i went ahead and i'm washing her binkies her toys that go into her mouth on the daily her bottles and then i'm also putting them in the sanitizer so they can get extra extra clean and as you guys saw i'm using dapple to clean all of these this is the first year's sanitizer i really like it it's got a compartment for like all the nipples on top and then it's got a compartment for all of the bottles make sure to temperature test your bottles if you do warm them up because you do not want to give your baby a hot bottle and this bottle was way too hot so i just let it cool down and i put some fresh sheets in her crib so she was really comfortable she was gonna go to sleep like a baby <laughs> literally but we do use a sound machine y'all i can't even sleep without a sound machine like what this thing just knocks me out we put it on white noise and she she can't sleep without it i can't sleep without it we can't sleep without it look at her little legs y'all she is so cute i cannot but this is the time when i pray over my child this world is crazy 
And though we can't have trust in a lot of things, one thing you can trust in is God. Pray over your child. Speak the name of Jesus over your child, over the room your child sleeps in. And rest assured knowing that your child is in God's hands. God crafted your child. God placed that child into your womb. And God is going to cover your child every day of their life. I even got my oil out. Y'all know how I get. Plead the blood, okay? Plead the blood of Jesus. But I love you. I thank you. I appreciate you. I hope you got something out of this video. And if you did, make sure to let me know down below. Good night.